In today's video, I'll show you my favourite wrapping settings with Auto-Tune for FL Studio. So, to get started, if I click on one of the tracks, I chose track 10, call it microphone or mic. Choose a colour, press accept and hit the check mark. So it's in. Options, audio settings. FL Studio ASIO, choose your microphone here in the menu. Go to slot 1 in the right tab on the mixer channel. Go to more plugins and find the auto tune plugin. You can download this on various sites. Like I found this version here on a YouTube tutorial on where to find it. <coughs> So here I chose the key, I want to be in G minor, because um, I've got quite a low voice, so I've chose the one that will pick up the best. Retune speed set zero, pitch amount 100%, variation rate, onset delay, and onset rate all set to the lowest setting, 0 0.1, 0, 0, 0, 0. Transpose, put that to number 2. There we go, so that's going to make your vocals very cut. Now I'm going to switch over to um, in-game, in-app uh, in vocal um, setting. Okay, in the mixer you choose into, you should be able to hear me now and hear your own voice. So you can hear I've got auto-tune on my voice. Now you click on slot 2 and you choose chorus. You leave that as default, you move it around to about quarter, the first quarter on the audio bus. And you go down to delay 2, two and you two choose, two choose two ping two pong, two pong, two pong, two and you, and you two move two it down two to your health voice, it's going to be like really weird. And then you go to reverb, and you move the size down to around a little bit here on the side. And that's quite good, so you leave that on the maximum. Uh, Wait, actually you move it down to about here, so it's about a bit more than the delay. And then compressor, so you choose vintage. The vintage reset is now enabled, and you put the volume down to quite like really low on there. Next thing you do is sound good nicer. Key on C, and you turn that one down, and you turn this one down. So you should still be able to hear yourself quite loud. And then, um, how else do I do it? Um, love filter, and you choose the default setting. Just move the cut to about here, so your voice sounds quite cut now. And I go to Fruity Panda Metric EQ. You right click the first one, you choose High Pass, move these together. Um, use your scroll wheel to make these a bit more cut, and drag them down. Boost this one to about here, so it sounds like quite cool. Lift this one up a little bit, and so you just play around and find where you want your um, vocal to be. Bang. So oh, I like this one here. And then you go to the other EQ, and another one, and you put on vocal presence. So you roll this one up and cut it down like that. So it's just one up is quite a lot. And you boost the high, so you can hear yourself quite well. Uh, and then you can basically sing with these vocal settings. Um, I don't have anything on the slot 10. Playlist. You mute your instrumental for now. You click record and you can sing. Once upon a time I had fun in my car. I was riding there. Really fast on the road like a blood line there. I was alone in stride riding down on the road again I was so fast You can't even keep up with me I was riding It's okay you got all the uh, audio when you cut this off You can duplicate the track You can change the volume there so it's a little bit louder So um, I'm just going to change the vocal back so you can hear me voice twice and then you listen to the playback with the instrumental on 
I'm just gonna call him up on there. So I've just recorded in the two vocals. Now I'm gonna show you how I do ad libs. Okay, we're back on my and vocal track for the mixer so you just choose your micro input and then you just basically record some random sounds that sound a little bit too, like words the tune so you hit play and record and you go yeah eh, yeah So you've got all your vocal ad libs in. You can also duplicate this if you want. So I'm just going to choose my vocal way. Listen to these. Yeah. Uh, right, select everything so you can hear it full. Okay, so you get the picture, I've got the um, vocals down, then you go to File, Export, MP3, and you click Save with the title you would choose, so Riding, let's say, that's your song title you could have, I'm not going to do it obviously, so you save that, enjoy the video, like and subscribe, and peace.